couple years ago, I was invited to the Tenenbaum house for Easter Sunday. We were sitting around the dining room table when Mr. Tenenbaum gave me some dating advice, <laughs> which has really resonated with me. <laughs> he said, finding love is like trying to catch a butterfly, but if you're quiet and least expecting it, that butterfly will land on you. But if you're running around, flailing your arms, that butterfly is going to fly in the other direction. <laughs> Never in our years of friendship have I ever known Tori to not take a piece of Mr. Tenenbaum's advice. But when Tori first laid eyes on Big C here, she was that girl running around, flailing her arms <laughs> to catch that butterfly. And thank God he landed. Since the moment you were born, you have brought pure joy to mom and I. Your zest for life, kindness to people, inner strength and perseverance are qualities that will serve you and Colin well throughout your life together. If you had told me nine years ago that I would be standing here in front of you all on this beautiful evening, I would have called you insane. See, Tori and I went to college together. Go Mugs. Um, and for the first couple years, we simply were not fond of one another <laughs> at all. Thankfully, that's changed. Colin, Tori will tell you that I kept my silence on other young men that I met before you. <laughs> she understood that by not expressing an opinion that I was saying a lot. After your first meeting, she knew that you got that seal of approval. You have a wonderful, kind demeanor and a good heart. We know that you will honor, protect, and love her as a husband should. I've known Colin for over 20 years, um, and he's been a, an extremely huge part of my life. Um, I met him in eighth grade under some pretty uncomfortable circumstances. Uh, I was the, the new kid in school, and best way to put it, Colin was the, the big boss dog um, in the grade. <laughs> so um, once, uh, once he realized that I was not a threat, he put his guard down, um, <laughs> and we became, uh, we, we, we became best buds uh, ever since. Did you know Tori was the one? Take your time if you need a minute to respond. Immediately he responded saying, I knew Tori was the one after she surrounded my mother with you beautiful angels during her cancer surgery without me ever asking. <laughs> Tori, your love and loyalty has no match and we are so grateful for that. Colin, the first time I knew you were the one was the first time you left for the weekend. I spent the night at the house with Tori, and when I went up to the guest room, you had left me snacks on my pillow. <laughs> and right then and there, I knew we weren't letting you go. <laughs>
wonderful life together, filled with love, health, laughter, and always be devoted to each other. I think you're the best, Colin. You, you've, been, uh, you've been my right-hand man since the day I met you. Um, I love you to death. Tori, I love you to death. I, I've got all the confidence in the world that you guys are going to have a long and happy life. Tori and Colin, I am so glad you two have found each other to travel this life with. So friends and family, please raise your glasses and join me in a mazel tov, a la salute, slanja, and cheers to Mr. and Mrs. Colin Haley. Today, Colin and Victoria make the biggest decision of their life. They have decided to say yes to love, to say yes to the love for each other, to say yes to the love that God has for them. Knowing that this marriage is permanent, may the two of you strive daily to show each other tenderness, love, and respect. Colin, you may now break the glass and kiss the bride. <laughs>